What's up YouTube? It's your man, Big B Production 100. I have a great video for you guys tonight. Now last week I showed you guys how you can get that cool iOS 7 home lock screen that we currently have for our iPad and iPhones for OS 10 Mavericks as your screensaver. But this week I got something even better for you guys. In this video I'll be showing you guys how you can get that cool Space Vortex screensaver from Time Machine Animation that we all love in OS 10 Mavericks. Now, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm going to show you. Now, this is the old space vortex, but it's all I have for you guys for right now. So, Now, with this one, you can choose your RSS feeds to play on your screen as your screensaver go by, which is pretty cool. Or if you don't have any RSS feeds and you don't want to have those for your screensaver, you can just simply have the space vortex, like so. So, uh... That's pretty much it. But uh, anyway, let's jump right into it. I'm going to put the links down below in the description where you can go and download those screensavers. But once you download them, they'll go to your downloads folder like so or your desktop. Once you have them to save to your desktop, you know, you simply just want to open it up like so. This would be the file that you would have to double click on to open it. Once you double click, you'll be presented with the installation instructions and drop here. And there will also be two more items in here. Those two items that you would have would be the screensavers itself. Now from there what you would have to do is you would have to go to your library folder. Now if you don't know how to find your library folder I'm going to show you how. You can simply go to your home folder. In this case mine is Bryant's iMac. From there I would then go to iBryant OS X which is your main hard drive and you will see right here your library folder. Once you go inside here you would see another folder that folder would be called screensavers. Just double click. Now we're going to open up two windows. Now let's go back to the downloads folder like so. And now what you would do is you would grab those two items, which is the two screensavers. One screensaver would say Time Machine RSS, and the second screensaver would say Time Machine QTZ. Drag both of those items like so to this window and drop them inside here. Now I'm not going to do that because I've already done it. And if you'll look here, you'll see the two items I was telling you about. So you want to take these two items, drag them and drop them in this folder. Now remember, those will be in your downloads folder. Take them and drag them and drop them to your screensavers folder. Once that's done, you can go up to the top to the Apple menu, open up system preferences like so, go to desktop and screensavers. From here, you'll click on screensavers and simply just go down and you'll see RSS time machine and time machine. And let's check out our preview. And this is what your screensaver would look like once you set up your own RSS feed. Or well, again, if you don't like the RSS feed, you can simply just have the plain vortex space like so. And you'll see it is 11.45 p.m. So. I'm about to get out of here and give me some sleep in a minute. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Once you uh, choose your RSS time machine screensaver, you can just choose screensaver options. And from here, you would just put in the feed URL box, your own website or a website that you currently go to to get your feeds of your choice. And click done, like so. That's pretty much it. This your man. Big B Production 100, please rate, comment, and subscribe for your man if you enjoyed this video, which I hope you did. Holla at you.